Yo. Yo. Is that me? Man. Yeah, what's up, bro? Chilling. Can I have a conversation with you real quick? Yeah, what's up? Listen, if something happened, I don't know. I just woke up. Yeah, no, no, not. Well, I mean, not really. Kind of, but not. Really. Um, listen, I, uh. I'm just going to speak I candidly. Uh, I and just it. openly and straightforward. I, uh. So the other day, when uh, Hydra was chilling out in the barrio, um. Doing their thing. Yeah. GG was down there. Uh, Forehead, I think Future. Who else was there? I There's went like there three for a four member. Uh, I think Jamal was you, there. Uh, and yeah, Jay, right? That, that's right, Jay. Exactly. So anyway, we were all just down there chilling, vibing, whatever. And, uh, you know, GG, I, I asked GG, I was like, yo, you know, what do you got? What, how do you guys feel about this? Or he was, like, uh, I think it was Forehead that said, like, oh, I don't know, man. Like, you know, they, they should go and take, uh, they should go and take Grove. And I was like, nah, bro, they ain't gonna, they ain't gonna take Grove. Like, <laughs> the ball is a hand of their business, right? It ain't gonna work out, right? Yeah. Because, I mean, we've seen, we've seen, we've seen gang after gang try and take that, that street, and it never works out. I mean, out, I don't right? know why like, they want that shit anyway, bro. That shit cursed. Correct. It's, it's, it is cursed. <laughs> I ain't never, I, <laughs> never. So, uh, and you know about it. So, anyway, uh, I ended up talking to, to Flippy, just trying to get the tea on what's going on, because I hadn't been around for a little bit. And uh, then I just heard earlier that the beef between Vagos and Hydra are done, and they're kind of they're moving on. So anyway, I'm 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 coming back from uh, from doing my rounds over in Cyprus, and I saw a bunch of people over in uh, the apartments in your guys' turf, um, the old Azteca place uh, where the Dons used to be. And uh, so I roll up. Actually, a guy he actually runs up to my car. I didn't even really approach them, but they he kind of approached me. And he was yelling, he was saying, you know, is there any baddies down here in the south side? I was like, what do you mean baddies? Like, you know, any girls? I'm like, ah, no, there's not that many. It's just small talk. And then, oh, shit, something's going down. Uh, so anyway, I, uh, I say, oh, what you guys, uh, are you guys trying to, like, you know, move in here? And he said, uh, I'm sorry, I'm turning off my radio. And he said, uh, the, the guy from, from Hydra, he said, well, yeah, well, we don't know. Uh, you know, we're, we're still, we're, we're looking around, we're, we're trying to figure it out type thing. So I said, okay, cool, man, cool. So, you know, uh, being a good friend that I, we like to try and be to you guys. I, I gave forehead a call cause uh, he's usually awake during these hours. Like when I am. Yeah. And, uh, I said, yo, I said, yo, forehead, like, uh, just let you know, like, I don't know if you know this or not, but like Hydra over in, uh, over in your backyard, essentially. And at the apartments, like, are you guys planning to you know, to give that to them or whatnot. And he didn't say yes or no. He basically said, well, how do you feel about that? I was like, well, I, I'm, it doesn't matter. It's, it's not my turf and, and I actually like Hydra and stuff. So like, I'm not against it. Like, uh, I just didn't like the way that they were doing it against the Vagos, but you know, they can find another place like, hell yeah. Like I, I'm basically all for it. And he was like, oh, okay, cool. Yeah. It's good to know. Good to know. He's like, well, <laughs> we don't really know yet and, and stuff. I said, okay, nothing. And we just, we just ended it. Like 60 seconds later, two minutes tops, Flippy calls me, pissed the f and he's like, he's like, what, like, what's your problem? Why are you in my, why are you in my business? Why are you talking shit? I'm like, what do you mean talking? And he was like, well, I was like, I don't, I, I haven't said anything bad about Hydra. And he's like, well, I want you to really think about that. I want you to really <laughs> think about that. And I was like, oh, what? The other day when I was down, because it was the only negative, the only semi-negative thing that I, that I even said about Hydra, but it was like a general it was like a general thing about anybody that goes down there and tries to take Grove because you know you know how the ballers are and they'll wake yeah. up in droves and hold shit down like it just ain't gonna happen. And I, I and I said what was it the fact that I told Gigi this? So the the like Ming, I'm 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 just keeping it a hundred, man. Like we do a lot for you guys and like borderline, uh, like we we're supplying you guys with meth run after meth run. You know, I tried to work out a deal with Marty about the meth lab. He brought it to me. I didn't bring it up to him. And, you know, I had called him, you know, looking for it. And then he said, okay, well, you guys might have other plans for it. So, you know, you didn't know if he was going to keep it and whatnot. So that's cool. And I had a meeting with BSK the other day about um, our, our workings with, now with we actually GG. Do get and I was like, you know, I'm going to bring it up and, and you know, see if anything is going. Because, you know, we, we try and do a lot for you guys. But I'll, I'll tell you, man, it makes me feel a certain way. When, you know, I'm saying things in private between the two of us, like as friends, and it's immediately going to the other side and it's, it's almost being 
uh, perceived as if I'm talking behind someone's back in a negative manner, when in reality, that's not really it at all. And it just kind of seems a bit two-faced, if I'm being honest. And, it, you know, I, I, you know I, I, I don't know what else to say about it. Like, I don't know exactly what Forehead said to him, but the fact that he calls me two minutes later super pissed, it's like, why, why do you even say that? Like, why would you even go and say something like that? It wasn't even like I said anything bad about them. You want me to get so, forehead down I'm, here? Cause, uh, yeah, I mean, it'd be it'd be cool. I mean, he's probably going to be the best one to talk to because like, I literally just woke up. I don't know about them uh, uh, taking that block. Hello? What the fuck are you doing? Uh, I was checking out with Speedy. Wait, you want to come down to the gas station real quick? OTC's here. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down, yeah. All right. There. All right, I'll come down. <clears throat> Did you, when you said the Bala thing though, did you say that at the Barrio or did you just say that? Yeah, I said it at the, I said it at the Barrio. Like, and I, I said it to GG members, like in a car, like they're, they're at a car or we just having a conversation between us. Oh. And then I, when, then when Flippy called me, I told him straight up, like, and I'm like, bro, like, and he's like, well, why does it like, get, get, keep your notice out of my business? I'm like, it is my business, bro. I'm one of the OGs down here in the South side. Like. I want to know who's who's moving in here. I'm not yeah, saying I don't wrong. want you to be it's down. Like, you know, if a new group it, comes down here, you kind of want to know a little bit about them before you just fucking. Correct. And like, and there are other things I want to tell Flippy to his face, but I didn't want to. I didn't want to escalate things because it's like, dude, I really don't have a problem with you, and we've been super cool and chill for like nine months. So why am I why am I going to do this? But like, how I really feel is like, dude, you've you've had what a home in Little Soul. You had a home down there, and now you're just going to come and bulldoze your way down here. And there's a lot of shit that I could that I could say in a, in a negative light, but I just refrain from doing so because I like respect the guy and he's been around a long time and I want to see more people down here. It's just about how you move. That that was pretty much it. And I mean, you know, Flippy did call me back, like, because he was like, oh, he's like, bro, you're weird, and he hung up on me. I'm like, what the, f like, like what exactly did Forehead <laughs> tell this dude? Like, and then he called me like, you know, a few minutes later, like five minutes later. <laughs> And he was, he didn't even apologize. He was just basically like, okay, well, you know, let me speak. And there's a, maybe it was a, a little bit of a misunderstanding or uh, maybe we can just agree to disagree. I'm like, okay, man, like, it's all good. Like, I, I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. I mean, I, I don't know shit, bro. I literally just woke up. Like, yeah, I know you. I know. You. I came down to find forehead, but. Yeah, I think uh, he's on his way down here. Yeah. Oh, what's up, OTT? Yo, what's up, forehead? Forehead, can I talk to you in private for a minute? Hey, you guys did yeah. I think I know what this is gonna be. Yeah, what's up, bro? Like, I, okay. what, like, bro, come on, man. What did it say? Come on. It doesn't matter what he said, forehead. Like, we do a lot for you guys, almost on a daily. We basically cook just for you at this point. Okay. And like, we do, we do so much shit for y'all. And like, comments that I made uh, to you about about ballas and and them. And then me calling you up to give you a heads up that like Hydra's over there in, in, in your guys' territory. And then all of these things are going right back to Flippy and I get Flippy pissed off uh, talking shit to me 60 seconds after I have a conversation with you, man. It's just not a good look. Okay, okay. Um, the calling part? I, he called me up as soon as you, as soon as you called me up, he calls me up. He's like, who, who you on the phone with? I'm like, what do you mean? I said, I'm doing some business on the phone. He asked me who I was on the phone with. I didn't tell him. I said, I'm doing business on the phone. So he, he just assumed that you called me. Like, I didn't tell him that you called me on the phone. Like, I didn't tell him who called me on the phone at all. He just assumed it. Okay. Like, I, I'm not lying to you. That's what happened. He called me up. He's like, yo, who you on the phone with? Or is it OTT? Like, he, he just assumed that it was you on the phone with me. All right. Now the the other thing, the ballers thing, yeah, that's fair enough. That was hood news, and we would, yep, yeah, we did say it. Maybe we shouldn't have said it. I'll own up to that one. That's on us. But the phone thing is that's just that's just him. I don't know. He assumed All right. It. All right. I believe you. I believe that's why I just wanted to come down. Like I'm not gonna like sit here and talk shit about you and stuff. Like I just like come down, hash it out, figure this shit out. Cause like the way the from the outside looking in, it's like man, we're. It's like, I'm telling these guys stuff, like, as a friend, and it's just going back to the other side, and it, it, it's making me no, look I, like I I'm get, a, I like get a, that. I get that, right? I, I understand. Listen, the phone call, I don't know. He just assumed that you was on the phone with me instantly. And I told him, no, I'm doing a business call. And, and then he just, he just, 
like he just knew. You know what I'm saying? Like he just knew it was you on the phone. Now, like yeah. I said, the other the other thing with, when we said yeah, the, all that that was hood news. Maybe we we're out of pocket. I agree. We should not have said it. But like, you know, we said it for hood news to be dumb. And I apologize for that. That's on us. Um, you know, that's my mistake. But the phone call shit, that's just I don't know. He just assumed it. All right. All right. Well, that's that's all. That's all. I mean, the the hood news shit. I get it. I get it. Um. But you know, <laughs> you know, you know how you know how people get. You know what I'm saying? You no, say I get it. And it's like, and I told Flippy, I told Flippy on the phone, the, like you know of, of what I said. And I mean, I stand by it. Like anybody that tries to go down there and take Grove, like <laughs> it ain't working. It, it ain't gonna happen, right? You're gonna get smoked. Or you're gonna get pushed out. Like they're just never gonna give up. So you know, it is what it is. That stands for anybody. I mean, we couldn't take Grove. Can Chang Gang couldn't take Grove? Nobody can take Grove. It's just. It's just the way it is. Yeah, listen, the the the, uh, the ballers thing is, yeah, I don't know about the phone call. The phone call, like, I get that how the phone call looks bad. That one looks bad. You know what I mean? But I'm telling you, the yeah, guy yeah. just the guy just assumed it. The guy just like knew that you. Well, it makes the phone sense. It makes sense because when he called me, he asked me who I was, uh, who I was, ta or who I was talking to on the phone or something. He's like, who did you call? Or you call Forehead or something along those lines? Or he asked me. I was like, dude, I was, I talked to Forehead. And he's like, well, what? You know, he's like. I don't even know, but he he was making it almost seem like I was talking shit, but like I wasn't talking shit. Like even when I talked to you, I was like, I didn't say anything. I wasn't like Hydra. They don't belong down here. Don't fucking give them any turf. Don't do this. This. I said, hey man, I I'd like to see them down here, but like it's all about how they come down. It's your turf. You can do what you want. You know, I like Hydra. So anyway, it just uh, I don't know. He just. Cussed me out. Was angry over nothing. Listen, listen, I like, I, listen. I know how the phone call shit can look bad, right? Like the like the the baller stuff. Like we did that shit for hood news. Like try to be funny, right? Mm. Uh, but the phone call. I get how the phone call looks really bad. So, but like, like I said, I don't know. I, I, I didn't tell him anything. I, I just said I'm doing a business call, bro. So I don't know. Like he just knew. Gotcha. As soon as he called me, he knew I was on the phone with you. Like I don't. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I mean, it is what it is. Is you know, I he knows me. He know. I guess he knows how I roll. So it's all good. Anyway, I'm happy we chop it up, man. It's no hard feelings. I just thought I'd speak to you. Yeah, and, I get uh, it. just kind of yeah, hash it out. All right, brother. All right. Well, I mean, did he say anything? Like, you guys uh, get into some like. Uh, well, I mean, he basically told me I need to mind my own business, and I stood my ground, obviously. And I told him, I'm. I said, dude, I'm. I'm one of the only OGs left down here. Imagine if I came from the north down here in the south. You know the the OGs down here, the people down here would want to know what I'm doing and and whatnot. Here, they, what fuck, you know, man? and and then like uh, I was the gas station yet? I don't know. I I had him in like a a verbal headlock, and he just called me weird and hung up. And then <laughs> I was like, okay, well, I guess I guess like maybe I'm gonna end up having to fight Hydra now because I didn't know if he was just gonna spin the block and lose his cool. But then he called me like five minutes later, like calm down some. I think he realized like my point of view. Which I can respect, but he didn't even apologize. He's basically, let's just agree to disagree. He's like, I just don't like the way that you move. Like, he's like, I just don't like the way that you do things. I'm like, what do you mean? I was like, bro, I'm down here defending you. I've told several people that I wouldn't mind having you down here. It's, you, nobody down here can say that, like, I I've ever said, Hydra, they don't belong down here. They're not. I never once uttered those words or even anything close to it. So I think what it was, right? I think what it was, he... He heard the first thing about the ballers, and then he just assumed That's that you were, you were talking shit to me on the phone, right? That's it. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That ma which makes sense from his point of view. Yeah. So, but it is what it is. Uh, we're cool. I mean, he just said, he said it's all good. It's, it is what it is. And he, he said he needs to talk to Marty and stuff like that. So he said it might not even happen or anything. Like, you know, he doesn't know where they're going to end up being. So, so yeah, that, that's pretty much that. All right. All right, brother. Thanks. All right, well, you need something in the middle, all right? All right. All right, brother. All right. All right. You too.